Eamon Zayed is well known around Indy. The Irishman's in his second season as Indy 11's leading scorer. I've dedicated the last 17, 18 years to playing football. It's brought me um, to many, many countries, seeing different cultures. Um, football has paid for my college. It's got me through my degree, my masters. Um, I mean, football's been everything to me. Signing at just 17 with Leicester City, through football, Zayed's traveled the globe. Malaysia, for instance, um, it's completely different um, than the Middle East and Iran. Um, that's completely different than, than obviously Ireland and England and Norway and Europe. And now, Indy, and yes, Muncie. Eamon actually contacted myself. Um, he'd heard about what we'd been doing with the program and uh, inquired to see if there was any opportunity to, to work with us. There's not many coaching opportunities in Ireland. Um, there's only a handful of professional full-time jobs. But when I came over to America, I got to, to see that there are a lot more possibilities in coaching um, over in America. I mean, you know, you obviously have your university college coaching, um, you have your pro level coaching, you have your local clubs, um, and a lot of people are, are in full-time employment, whereas that's not the case in Ireland. So here he is, a volunteer mentor and a volunteer mentee. When I started my coaching badges, the feedback that I got from the other coaches was that I needed to explain things better. Um, they felt that I was coming from a professional level um, of 17, 18 years experience of playing. And I just expected these kids that I was coaching to understand um, what I wanted them to do. You know, that's not the case. I mean, depending on what level you coach, you, you have to really break it down. Well, it's working. He's really taught us to be aggressive in the box. And the biggest thing he says is for the forwards to really be aggressive when there's a cross or a pass and, you know, just go for it. After like the play's over, he'll kind of like tell us what we should have done or a run we should have made or if we should have taken a shot rather than passing. He's talking us through um, different scenarios where he's literally been possibly that weekend too. They always want to learn, which is great. You know, after training or before games or after games, you know, I have girls coming up to me asking me, my thoughts on, you know, how can they get better, and, uh, and I like that. And that, in and of itself, has made the entire experience worthwhile. I've loved it, I really have. I had my family over, actually, from Ireland. My mum and my sister came over, and I got them to watch, uh, come out and watch a game uh, a couple of weeks ago, and um, after the game, they, they said that, they said that I looked happy. I mean, I spoke with such enthusiasm about the girls and about the coaching and, and how it was going and how much I'm enjoying it, that um, it was nice for them to see it um, and tell me, you know, that it was something that they could see that I was really enjoying.